Good morning, you guys. Today I am going to be starting a spring cleaning and decluttering video. I don't have a plan. Um, I think the good part about us decluttering so much of our stuff is that I really don't have to have a plan for my cleaning because everything is pretty simple. The two things that I don't like to do are toilets and bathtubs, so my husband does that. I'm going to just kind of go room by room, look around the room, see if there's anything that I can like immediately declutter, start making a big old pile of that, and then also kind of just wiping everything down, dusting, and doing like the floors and stuff like that. And just kind of taking a look and seeing if anything needs like um, a wash. So I'll probably be doing some laundry today more than normal, like sheets or comforters, or um, if I need to like vacuum couches and stuff. I'm just gonna kind of be just going with the flow. That's kind of how I like to clean. I feel like if I have a plan, unless my house is really messy, I don't like having a list that I like don't stick to. So I just kind of like to see where I can get to, and maybe this can be like a two-part video, two days. I probably will get hot and I will change out of my sweater, but don't think that means that it's a second day. I'll let you guys know if this is a two-day clean, but let's just go ahead and get started. I'm excited for you guys to join me. If you're new here, I'd love it if you would subscribe. Let's get started on this video. Something I've known that I want to declutter is these two baskets. I haven't used them for anything. I won't use them for anything. I recently read a book that kind of inspired me to declutter more of our stuff. Um, one of my t big takeaways was that going through your stuff, ask yourself, do I need it now? Don't ask yourself about the future, but ask yourself, do I need this item now? And will I buy it again if I get rid of it? And the answer to those questions is no to these. So they're gonna go. <laughs>
morning you guys it is day two of this deep clean i told you guys i'd let you know if this is a two-day process and it definitely is Riker has woken up from his nap we've run some errands but i wanted to go ahead and do his room while he is awake basically going to be doing what i'm doing to the other rooms just trying to dust everything off kind of work from ceiling to floor as much as i can get the baseboards which i never do and vacuum the floors and just anything else that I see will also get wiped down. So let's just hop into the second half of this video. Thank you. 
did also want to mention in this video, it has been um, a couple days since I started this video. We decided to get a new couch. So our living room is kind of um, chaotic right now. So I have tape down here on the floor. We taped out where our new couch is gonna be and everything has just been kind of like thrown around. Furniture has been moved. And then of course Riker has been playing all day today. So there's toys everywhere. Part of this cleaning routine for me just I'm trying just to do the things that I normally wouldn't do on a regular basis and kind of ignoring the things that I would do on a regular basis so that I can get the extra stuff done so it's kind of just I kind of neglected the rest of the house but at the end of the day I like to do a big cleanup and so that's probably when I'm gonna pick up all the toys wipe down the tables and the counters in the kitchen and do the dishes and stuff like that. But right now, that is not a priority. So it's just kinda gonna stay a mess, even though I am cleaning.